What's going on guys? Welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be heading down to the lake and we're just going to go bring our net and see what we can catch. So I'll see you there. So I just got to the docks and there's this tree right here and there's so many squirrels in it and massive walnuts keep falling. <gasps> it's a baby squirrel. Look, it's so cute. Okay, let's go catch some fish. Now I'm over here with my net just looking around, seeing if there's any turtles or little, I don't know, little cool creatures we can catch, but I'm not seeing any. There's a little snail shell right there, but I doubt that there's a snail in it. And if there is, it's probably dead. And I'd rather not touch that. So we're just gonna keep walking. Hmm, now I'm over here on the dock. This is the squeakiest dock ever, but I'm not really seeing anything. The only thing I see are some tiny little minnows that are darting around, but I can't really catch those because my net is this long. I don't know where my other net went, but look how pretty this is. Like, it's all like a big bed of plants. I'm, I'm guessing that if you step in it, you just fall down like a foot or two, but it looks pretty cool. And I bet in here there are so many turtles and stuff. Look how big that feather is, but I don't know where they are. So I see a ton of fish swimming through here, but just think of all the turtles that are hiding in here. Now something I find really interesting is how all the plants grow here and then they come on this side and it's like completely clear, like you can see the bottom. You see? So like there's plants on this side, no plants on this side. I don't know why. Like it's the same water, same dirt, I don't, I don't know why. Just interesting. Okay, so I'm just looking for little fish, um, anything that we can- there is no way. Is he alive? There's a baby soft shell right here. <gasps> He's alive. He doesn't look very good. What's wrong with him? Guys, I actually just found a baby turtle here. It is later in the season and usually they don't hatch now, but I found one and it's a soft shell turtle. I'm not sure if he's like sick or anything. I don't know. Here he is right here. This is what he looks like. Let it focus. There you go. It looks like he still has his umbilical cord right here. If you can see that. See that? And when I hatched turtles last year around this time, which I guess maybe that would make sense, they had an umbilical cord just like this guy. So maybe we just have to wait a couple days for it to soak up. But look how cute he is. He's so adorable. So right now I'm headed back over to the area where I found this little guy in the first place to see if there are any more. Because usually when turtles hatch, they'll hatch together with all their little siblings in a clutch, it's called. So I'm just going to look over here, kind of out of breath, because I was just running. But uh, I found him right here, so I'm just going to look around and see if I can see any more little baby turtles. This is where I found him, right here. He's right there now. So I'm guessing he probably came from on this side or the other side of this ramp. But he was just on the ramp, so I honestly don't even think that he's been swimming yet. Because he has dirt on him, and if he had been swimming, then the dirt would have gotten off. So I really highly doubt that he's ever been in the water yet. Okay, I'm really not finding any over here, but I'm going to take a quick look along the grass where the turtles would have laid their eggs. And I'm going to check if there are any more of his siblings over here. Thank you all so much for watching this video. Here's our little turtle right here. Make sure to drop down some name suggestions for him because he doesn't have a name yet. And also only 5% of you guys are subscribed. So make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and we will see you in the next video.